make the same call to Goswin Akwabio that as a retired senator who is not going to be with us in the ninth assembly, you should also continue or start to do those things that will continue, that will propel the prosperity of this country. Akwabio, I will miss you in the ninth senate, but we will definitely meet on the streets of Abuja. A privilege for me to be here. The civil senate president, I, I know some time ago when we had the valedictory session, uh, one of my very younger brothers that I, I admire so much has said we will meet on the streets of Abuja. But I'm very delighted that through the privilege of Mr. President, President Muhammad Buhari, GCFR, a man of excellence, a man who believes in good governance, a president who loves Nigeria, and a man that is very determined to leave a legacy of good governance for this country. We are now meeting here in the Senate. I had assured him that we shall meet, and we are meeting today. President, uh, you and I know that I have forgiven you if you wrong me. And uh, even when we are departing from here, if there is reparation or if there is still need, you can still see me outside here after. And then for my colleagues in the, in the entirety of the Senate, I want to thank all of you for indulging me and for particularly as, uh, tolerating me in the tribunal. I have not withdrawn my case from the tribunal. I actually won the election, but maybe because of a uh, mistake in collusion, occasioned by INEC, uh, and so we had to go to the tribunal. So I assure you that the Ninth Senate, uh, you, you will see me in the Ninth Senate. Definitely you will see my face in the Ninth Senate, and this is for sure. So I will continue to do my best to contribute my quota to Nigeria. When I came here, I came here as a PDP senator, but as I'm departing the Eighth Senate, I'm departing as an APC uh, chieftain and senator of the APC. And uh, I know that I'm not the only one uh, Senator, you don't interrupt me. Uh, even the Senate President came here as an APC Senator, and when he's living here today, he will be living as uh, a PDP Senator. I don't know why a lot of uncommon things happen in the Senate. Mr. Uh, President, uh, you and I know. I want to assure my brothers and sisters that the service to humanity is not only in this chamber. I encourage the likes of Mori Ben Bruce to continue to do those things. Those beautiful ideas should not expire because you are not in the Senate. You should continue to contribute your quota to national development. I make the same call to Goswin Akwabio that as a retired senator, who is not going to be with us in the ninth assembly, you should also continue or start to do those things that will continue, that will propel the prosperity of this country. Akwabio, I will miss you in the ninth senate, but we will definitely meet on the streets of Abuja. I thank you very much, my colleagues. The battle to salvage this country is not a battle of no retreat, no surrender. We should continue to stand by the truth, not minding who's us is God. Congratulations. Assalamu alaikum. Senator. So, the civil senate president, my name is Goswil Obotakwabio. I come from the south south part of Nigeria, specifically Akwaibom State. I have submitted my CV. I represented the good people of Akwaibom Northwest Senatorial District in the 8th Senate. I did my best. In fact, I took time to elaborate some of the constituency projects that I, I undertook in the 8th Senate. The reason is very simple. So that if Nigerians should see that CV and see the quantum of what we are doing here, they will be very, very happy. And they will continue to support the civil senators to take such projects to the grassroots. It is my firm belief that the only way we can touch the lives of the less privileged in the society 
is through these hollow chambers. So I took time to elaborate those things. If you go inside, you will see some of the health centers, some of the hospitals, the roads that we were able to do. Not much, maybe two kilometers, 2.5 kilometers, and, so, and even intervening in the educational aspect and all that. I took time to do that so that you go through it, it will encourage you, it will also encourage your society. So I want to thank all of you uh, for giving me audience. Nothing really to say than what you already know. I'm regarded as an uncommon performer in any place I go to. And that is why standing in front, <laughs> standing in front of you, uh, I will not change. I want to assure Mr. President and the Senate that I will not change. I will continue to offer on Yeah, Mr. President, today, uh, one of my colleagues said that you will miss me because I'm not coming back to the Senate. I will say, no, that's not correct. I'm actually going to be one of those who will be delayed because I'm in the tribunal. I have not withdrawn my case from the tribunal. I actually won the election, but maybe because of a uh, mistake in collusion, occasioned by INEC. Uh, and so we had to go to the tribunal. So I assure you that the ninth Senate, uh, you, you will see me in the ninth Senate. Definitely you will see my face in the ninth Senate, and this is for sure. So I will continue to do my best to contribute my quota to Nigeria. When I came here, I came here as a PDP senator, but as I'm departing the eighth Senate, I'm departing as an APC uh, chieftain and senator of the APC. And uh, I know that I'm not the only one uh, Senator, you don't interrupt me. Uh, even the Senate President came here as an APC Senator, and when he's living here today, he will be living as uh, a PDP Senator. I don't know why a lot of uncommon things happen in the Senate. Mr. President, uh, you and I know that I have forgiven you if you wrong me. And uh, but even when we are departing from here, if there is reparation or if there is still need, you can still see me outside here after. And then for my colleagues in the, in the entirety of the Senate, I want to thank all of you for indulging me and for particularly as a...